Hey there guys, welcome back to some more Let's Play Super Mario 64, part number 12. Uh, last episode, we pretty much took care of Shifting Sandlands, and now we're ready to finally open this door. I mean, we have plenty of stars to do this. Uh, the requirements are 30 stars, I believe. Actually, we almost have like enough stars to open up the, the final area of the game, but um, we'll get there when we get there. So let's go inside this little watery thingy into Dire Dire Docks. Another one of those levels that just has really nice music from level 3. Um, do I like this better than what level 3? Absolutely. I think there's just more about this level than meets the eye. Um, for starters, I love it when, when you go through like these certain parts of the levels, the music kind of changes. Um, and uh, it's, it, it builds up I guess it builds up the suspense of what's going to happen at this side. But pretty much this star <laughs> right here is pretty simple. Um, we gotta avoid the bows! I mean, we gotta board up the bows' sub. Um, which I don't know how we got that sub in the first place, but whatevs. <laughs> he must have he must have worked hard to buy a submarine. I don't know. How does Bowser, how does Bowser even afford a submarine? <laughs> Anyways. So let's hit the switch, let's climb up, and our stair is going to be on this little sub. Pretty simple. Um, and we need to do this star because we have to uh, um, clear up something. Because that little thing that was just behind that little watery thingy right there is now opened up. Um, and that's going to take us to our next Bowser level. Um, actually... Yeah. I guess we'll go ahead. Yeah, we'll do this right now. Just to get it out of the way. So welcome to the second Bowser level. As you can see, don't touch the lava. <laughs> um, from what from what Course 7 has taught you, you're gonna, it's going to apply to this as well. So you got to watch out for that. Um, but we got some nice little, little puzzles first and foremost. Got to just pay attention to the, the graded platforms. These little things right there will sink. And then we got more of those little bully guys. I must say though, some of these red coins here are place evil. Like there, there's some of those spots that are just so darn evil. Like why would you place red coins there? <laughs> it's a trap. It's a, it's a death trap. But anyways, uh, let's just head up here. There's a box if you want to refill on health right there. I mean, you could also just use that hard thing down there too. I'm not sure if I explained that little hard thing. Uh, maybe I have, but basically if you run low on health, uh, I mean, you probably saw this in the first part when I was playing uh, Bomb on Battlefield. Because there's like a little heart up in the mountains that if you basically like run into it, it, re it restores your health. So there you go. Um, so let's just keep on climbing up here. Uh, this is quite a big level so to speak um, for a Bowser level <laughs> so what's up here you may ask some more traps oh boy let's just lawn jump like a pro oh god uh, uh. this is the part oh jeez oh man this is the part where I don't like because of that little slope and not only that, but there's a bully enemy up there, and I don't like that. <laughs> I really just don't. So I'm just going to play it safe. I'm going to grab these coins here. And I think I mentioned this, but the coins don't really matter. You don't you don't uh, have to worry about collecting 100 coins in these Bowser levels. All you need to worry about is just collecting the 8 red coins in uh, these levels here. And that will just give you a secret star. Uh, so yeah. Now that we've finally made it up here, I can screw you, bully. I ain't gonna be bullied, no siree. Anyways, let's head up to this like weird, contrapted-looking area. <laughs> I have no idea. Like, it's probably just some weird uh, contraption thingy. But there's an extra life, and uh, up here, looks like we just gotta wait. <laughs> Uh, but there's another red coin up in this area. So let's just take our sweet, precious time here. There we go. Get that six coin. Uh, come on, make it! 
There we go. Alright. So in this box is a bunch of coins, and there's also a bomb on. But more importantly, this looks like death. <laughs> I really don't like this bot. So I'm gonna play it safe, hopefully. Get there as quickly as- Oh shit! Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. Yep. <laughs> Alright, well, there's that. This, this is not easy. So until then, I'll I'll meet you guys at the same spot. All right, back here. Let's uh, wait, 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 Mario. Mario, just stay right in the middle there. There we go. Number seven. All right, and then there should be. Yep, there's the last eight red coin over here. Ooh, nice little style getting that one up. <laughs> there you go. There's our star. Our stare. Give me that stare. <laughs> All right. So basically, we just got a wall jump right over here. Wall jump. There we go. Grab this. Star number 68. Man, can't believe how much we've made. <laughs> how much stars we just get in the last few parts. It's crazy. All right, so let's just jump down to this weird, like, funnel. I don't even know what it looks like, but it's just a funnel shape. And here's the bows! Ah, pastry me again, Mario! Can you see that I'm having a little time? Uh, now, return those missing stars. My troops in the walls need them. <laughs> Alright, bows. Oh, God. You need to lose a little weight there, bud. You, uh, just need to. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, anyways, so, he's, st he's still kind of uh, a nuisance, but he's got some new tricks, as you saw, like, he just ground pout at the whole stage. I don't know if that's even possible, man. But, uh, this guy go down, this guy will go down in one hit, if you throw him in those little spikes, just like last time. If I can remember to throw, <laughs> oh god. Um, but what I usually like to do sometimes is just bring them a little bit closer to the bombs and then do that. <laughs> I don't really like to go through like, oh, I think I'm going to get this or no. Like, I'm not really good at that. How oh, can it be that I'm lost? The, the power of the stars has been lost. Consider this a draw. Next time I'll be in perfect shape. Now, if you want to, your precious princess, come over to the top. I'll be waiting. <laughs> All right, Bows, give me that key. And there's that. Bowser in the fire sea cleared. It's a nice level. I mean, I'm not really a big fan of lava worlds or anything like that, but it's cool. It's a cool level. <laughs> Chests in the current. All righty, so now we're getting into the fun part of these levels is mostly <laughs> Most of these chests right here, and not to mention that little whirlpool right there, is just a nuisance. <laughs> I, I think this is the, the, my least favorite part of, the, of this level. Because there's just so many different traps going on here. Uh, you can get screwed if you mess up the, the chest. Not only that, uh, but luckily I think I remember the, the exact pattern. So the first, the first couple are like at the bottom here, like this little section. And then the last one is over by uh, the Whirlpool, which that can be kind of tough to get sometimes. I mean, luckily we got bubbles. Bubbles will restore your health if you ever need them. There's a shark just chilling out there. I'm not sure why the shark's going after Mario, but <laughs> just there. <laughs> um, so Mario, can you please? Oh, geez. If you ever get too close, yeah, just mash the heck out of the swimming button. Just mash the heck out of that button. I don't even care if it breaks. Just mash it. <laughs> uh, but there we go. Um, so let's go ahead and grab star number 69. You guys. You guys. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. Don't even think about it, man. Like, what is it with that number? We're about to change that though, so let's go back inside. <laughs> uh, let's go with not that star. 
I think I'm gonna do a different star, perhaps. In fact, I'm gonna take care of this one right here, because it's just there. Uh, this little, uh, I guess, manatee, stingray. Uh, yeah, we'll just call it stingray. <laughs> I think it's just called the manta ray. Uh, but we're gonna swim through these rings here. They're pretty easy, so you gotta swim through at least five of those. And I'm doing such a good job doing that <laughs> properly. But you wanna just maybe, like, hold the swim button so you can do, like, a little kick. So that way you don't have to worry about overshooting the manta ray. There we go. And it's so evil. They put that star, like, right underneath the, the vortex, the whirlpool. So, don't miss that. <laughs> or else you're screwed. There we go. Star number 70. Manta Ray's reward. Pretty simple. Oh, looky here. We found 70 power stars. The mystery of the endless stairs is solved. Oh, goody. Stuff that I really don't need to know just yet. That's okay. I mean, I guess... I guess it's cool because, like, in this game... Like, you can play this game however you want. Like, you can pretty much speedrun this game with, like, no stars. That's insane. I, that's why I love watching speedruns of this game. It's just so much excitement. But anyways, uh, what's next on our to-do list here? I guess what I'm gonna take care of is... Um, another, like, jet stream kind of thing. There's another little jet stream on the other side here. That we need the metal cap for that. So... Might as well just get rid of that out of the way. And I think that's going to be it for now. You know, that's pretty much enough. Managed to complete a Bowser section. Yeah, like that little jet stream right there. We got to fly through those... Or swim. <laughs> fly! We got to swim through these rings here. I guess the easiest way to do that. Um, if you want to, you could just swim through it. I've seen so many people say that it's possible that you can go... That you can collect the star with, uh, without the metal cap, and I want to know if it's possible, like really possible. I think I think uh, I've seen like some tool assist speed runs that they just they grab the star like right here because they place the star like in this jet stream. It's pretty insane. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be able to get it properly, but I tried. Or maybe, maybe I can get it. Let's see. I mean, I'm just mashing the heck out of the swimming button. I, I mean, I would, I would highly, <laughs> I would highly think it's possible if you just mash the swimming button. But it doesn't seem like it's gonna work. So I'm gonna have to go grab that cap again. Darn, I thought it would be possible. I, I know for sure you can get the star without the metal cap. But maybe that's just like some some weird mechanics that I'm missing here. But we're gonna do this the legit way. The legit way. And grab that stair. Our star number 71. That's probably gonna be it for now. Yeah, that's definitely gonna be it for now. We're pretty... I mean, it's kind of a short episode, but... Uh, next time, we're definitely gonna be taking care of the rest of Dire Dire Dogs for sure. And then hopefully move on to the final areas of the game here. Well, I wouldn't say final, but you get the point. So I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.